Lee, another really solid performance and crucially a big three points. Yeah, uh, first one at home and and I was saying like, I just want to get that first win at home and with fans there and um, but fair play to the players that they deserve a lot of credit again. Worked so hard, another clean sheet, creating chances, some great football at times. Um, but our togetherness and our fighting spirit, I think the, the crowd appreciated it and, and, and see that and got behind us. And yeah, most pleasing thing for me tonight, clean sheet, win. But seeing the players and the fans show their appreciation for each other after the great game was um, was was a good moment for me. Yeah. Scott Hogan gets us up, off and running and profiting from a high press and forcing Derby into errors. We see obviously watching them that, that that's what they try to do. Uh, some would say overplay but you have to be brave to do it but you, you, you can't get caught because if you lose the ball there then you you get punished. Um, and, and fortunately for us we, we punished them. Should have been more, should have punished them more but but we won that one in the first half and then the second half was the same. We, we pressed them high, won the ball and, and, and then broke. So, um, so yeah, I'd say that the game plan that, that we had worked. We had to tweak it a little bit here and there because they changed things. They went to a, a diamond second half and we had to tweak again, you know, but, but overall, again, credit to the players. And when the game did get stretched at periods in that second half, there's a solidity about your team now. Not once did they look vulnerable at all. No, again, that, that, that's, that's a, a togetherness and that's what we're installing here, a togetherness and a will to win and to help you make this play next year. If someone gets caught out of possession or makes a mistake, then can, can you help him? And, and that's what we're doing very well. And, and again, the players, it's not easy to do that, it's hard work. I see players sprinting 50, 60 yards to cover each other, you know, and and, and that helps you win games. If, if you cut corners and you don't do things like that, then, then that's how you lose games. So in clean sheets we're getting, it's not a fluke, it's hard work. Second goal really puts the game to bed and how pleased are you for Jeremy Beller, a player who's adapted so well to being asked to, 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 to do that left wing back role and he looks taken to it like a duck to water. Yeah, again, good players can adapt and Beller's a good player. So to so play in a position he'd never played before and in the first six games been outstanding every, every game. So I'm, I'm pleased he got the goal. Uh, he couldn't really have done much more tonight. He got what he deserved and um, I always say to the players, hard work, you get rewarded for it and, and tonight it was Bella's turn. Yeah. Troy Deeney you've been asked about all week. He gets the last 25 minutes and lifts his place again, doesn't he? Yeah, but that, that, that was always going to happen yeah. and, and Troy coming on, we needed that lift. Uh, the, the other striker, Juki, just run himself into the ground and, and it was time for Troy, come on then. Now, now you put a shift in for the lads and, and get the crowd going and he, he done well. He done well when he come on, his hold up play, brought others into the thing, just didn't fall for him in the box on a couple of occasions, but it, it, it suited him the way we play. Um, so yeah, again, he's only had a week to, to settle in, but I, I like to think he's enjoying it and, 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 and it's an honour. Not many people can say that they played in front of the team that they support. Um, I, I know it, I've done it and, and, and Troy would have loved every second of tonight. But I had to take a little bit of pressure off of him because everyone would have thought, Troy starting, oh, we're going to win 6-0. It wouldn't have been fair on the lads, you know, so um, I think he handled the situation very well. Have we got a job on our hands to keep a lid on the ability of Tahith Chong? Yeah, because he's a good player. In possession, out possession, he brings us something different that we don't have from, from any other player. So, um, yeah, he, he's, he's a good player and we're, and we're lucky to have him. Mm. Very finally, how much of a difference does a few thousand fans in that Tilton Road end make? A big difference, a big difference. If they would have been here against Stoke then, um, and Bournemouth, then who knows, we, we might have nicked a couple of more points along the way. but most important thing is that they're back now. I have to say, Craig and the directors have been working their socks off to, to make this happen. Mm -hmm. So um, well done to them because again, they've, they've helped us get over the line tonight. So, uh, so yeah, just delighted to see more people come and then hopefully 
we can fix other bits and get some more in <laughs> and more in and just trickle them in. So, um, so yeah, I'm delighted for everybody. Well done tonight, Lee. Cheers, thank you. Thanks.